I'm back with another video. And today is going to be with my friend when she gets in the camera. But anyways, I'm in a new setting because I'm living with her for a week because I had to move out of my dorm room. Yeah, they kicked the sister out, but it's okay because I will be back. But today's video is going to be like a little challenge video. I just made it up at the top of my head. You know, I just be bored, so... I just be making up dumb stuff. But anyways, so it's basically going to be called Build a Man. I'm basically going to give like horrible scenarios. So you just got to pick out of which one, like which one you want. So when she gets in the camera, yeah, we're going to get this thing started. Why she trying to look cute? Like, come on. First scenario, would you rather your man be a thief or would you rather your man <laughs> be a murderer? <laughs> Which one? Would you rather have your man be Ezel or would you rather have your man be Debo? Well, Debo had never killed nobody, but what would you Debo rather Debo just a fighter. Yeah. So would you rather, well, okay, a I fighter, a fighter, like a bully. A thief. A thief rather over. than, rather than like a fighter? No, over than killing somebody. Okay, there's, there's a scratch murderer, a fighter then, like a bully. A, a bully. <laughs> like everywhere he goes, he want to fight somebody. Yeah. <laughs> like he got a short fuse. Well, like a nigga like, look at you, wham, right in the face. Well, are they getting caught every time they steal? Like, <laughs> yo, she a convict, obviously. She, she down for her man stealing. No, I don't want neither. I want to fight. Okay, everybody. so but you got to choose one. Would you, you my family? <laughs> want to fight somebody? Like what? Would you rather have a man who's a bully, or would you rather have a bully? Okay, a bully or what? Or a thief, a man who just robbed. He could, he could steal from you. I would say a bully then. Why? But he could bully me, like. Yeah, that's see. I don't know. I, on the other hand, would just want a thief. Cause you ain't finna put be putting your hands on me. You ain't finna be touching. No. So, cause I would like just say if like okay, say if we running low on money or something like that. He can go out rob a bank. He can go He's out and get my in jail. I ain't say he getting caught. You can be a thief, a smart thief. We can, we can conjure a, a plan and we can, you know, okay, we can be well, smart. If, if he's not going to get caught, then of course I want a freaking thief. But if he's going to get caught, he's going to be in jail. Like, most of the time. What's the point of being in a relationship? Well. <laughs> and I'm not. If you going to jail, we ain't together. Why not? You, you don't have your man down? No. <laughs> Obviously, no, don't, get short, caught, don't get caught. Don't get caught up with short, her. Just a short amount of time. Like, but five, ten Mm. Next one. Would you rather have, I mean, would you rather your man be a liar or would you rather your man be a cheater? <laughs> he can lie about cheating. Facts. He can lie about what cheating. What is good about either one of them? <laughs> <laughs> so which one? Because well, he, he can lie about cheating. Worse. <laughs> no, <laughs> no. Cheating is worse. He can bring you back an STD. But if he can lie about cheating, still, he can have an STD, lie about having a freak STD. Like what? Either way. <laughs> so which one? A liar or a cheater? It honestly doesn't matter. Freaking liar. Like the liar? Know. Shit, all, everybody lie. <laughs> to be honest. Yeah. But I mean, about like, I'm not trying to say like I lie like <laughs> about crazy stuff. But I'm saying everybody has lied in their lifetime about something. Okay. Would you rather have... Are you making me spill the top of your head? Yeah. Would you rather have a man with three baby mamas? With three different baby mamas or a man with three different baby yeah mamas. with three different baby mamas or whatever who take care of his kids or would you rather have a man with one baby like one baby mama other than you and he take care of none of his kids i mean i'd rather him take care of his kids so you would rather choose yeah. deal with the like, three baby mamas and yeah. not just the one baby mama yeah why is that because like if if we end up having kids and we're not together, I'm freaking stuck with the kids. You don't think he? You don't think it'll be a slight possibility that you could change him and he, you know, stick around? Niggas ain't gonna change. No I'm kidding. Would you rather your guy be overprotective, like overbearing, like oh you can't wear that, you can't do this, you can't do that? You no, know, I've been through that. <laughs> or what? Shade. <laughs> But, um, <laughs> or would you rather your guy be, like, jealous? Isn't that kind of, like, same thing? Yeah, it is, kind of. Or not, you can say careless. But, I mean, oh, yeah, of course, careless. I'm going to pick overprotective rather than careless. Like, I don't want no guy who's going to care. 
about anything like what why well careless you? about yeah like careless just about what you wear be going out with see-through tights on he'd be like all right I mean, baby I, wear that stuff, but, I mean uh, i would want the guy that i'm with to be like yeah you don't need to wear that if i'm not around you yeah because i just I feel like that. that's but just if you like don't care what i wear at all like then why are we in a relationship exactly but then again, you shouldn't even put him in a predicament where he has to be monitoring your clothing, to be honest. Like, you yeah. should know what's acceptable and what's not acceptable. Not exactly. trying to say he your daddy or whatever, but you can't be going out with damn mesh shirts with the nipple piercing showing and think he gonna be okay with that. He not. Like, all right. Would you rather have a man who breath always stink or <laughs> would you rather have a man who armpits always musky? <laughs> Choose wisely, cause you gotta kiss him. But then if he, his armpits always musky. Yeah, like, you you can't cuddle with him. You can't be laid up with him. But the breath, the breath, like that's like, you wake up after you brush your teeth. Even your breath, even after you brush your teeth, your breath stinks. Well, I definitely don't want stink breath. Like, okay, so you, you won't stink. So you want on your armpits, basically. You want on your armpits. <laughs> yeah, I do. And why? <laughs> Why you want your armpits then? I feel like, you know how like, this is bad to say. What, what you gonna say? But you know how like, sometimes when you're around something that smells like, mm -hmm. you eventually get used to the smell. Never, <laughs> never, why ever get used to on your armpits. Never, why I get used to on your no, armpits. No, you do though, like, I've been around people. I mean, I'm sure everyone's been around people that like, who was musky bad and, and like, who smell like or been in a room that's where it one of, smells wait. bad. Then like eventually you get used to pause. Like, that's my pet peeve though. I hate them. when people come from outside, <laughs> come back in, and you you want to lay up in people's bed. That's my pet peeve. Like go wash your <laughs> underarms, go wash down. Uh uh no, you need to scrub your body before you come laid up in somebody's bed. Rather your man be broke with like no money, like he always depending on you. Always depending on you for stuff, or would you have? Would you rather have a one who ain't got like education? Like he just stupid, like he not book smart or street smart. So you would you rather have intelligence or would you rather have money? Like somebody who broke and don't got nothing. Would I rather have someone who's broke or someone yeah. who has no intelligence? Yeah. That those are both bad things. Clearly, that's what I'm saying. They, they all, all these choices are going to be bad. But so you have to build your man. Broke or one that is who's dumb, girl. This should I would be easy. Say broke. You would rather have a man that's broke, right? Yeah. Okay, I was just trying to make sure, like, because cause I, <laughs> I want somebody who's smart at least. Well, because I, I mean, if he's smart, why is he like, why he has to depend on me for stuff, like? Because he broke his hell. He ain't got no money. He ain't got no job. Okay, let me put it like that. Would you rather have a man with no job or one with no education? One with no job or no education. No job. But he asks you for money every time he need it. I mean, if he has no education, he's going to be, like, basically working a regular job. If he has no education, he probably can't even get a job. Not even at McDonald's. They they probably re they require you to have a high school diploma. He ain't even got that. Dropped mm -hmm. out of middle school. I mean, but there's people who are like that now and they're... They're fine. Good. But I would rather have a man with, <laughs> with no money. Because honestly, I will be whipping him into shape every day. You're going to go out and get a job. You're not going to be sleeping on my couch. You're not my, sleeping in my bed. Laying up under me with no no funds. It is not even like, oh, trying to be a gold digger, but you got to match my hustle. Like, if I'm going out and going to get it, if I'm putting food on the table and you can't even do that, but you asking me for $20 to go get a haircut? Boy, no. The answer is no. You're going to go out and hustle for yours. And, and as far as intelligence, you need to have the standard base. I'm not trying to say you have to have a college degree to be somebody in life, but you at least need to have, like, a high school diploma to at least be, yeah. you know, secure in what you want to do in life. So. Right. The question was, would she rather have a boyfriend that can't tell his friends no, like, oh, we going out, we finna do this, we finna do that, all right, I bet, I'm a slide, or whatever. Or would you rather have a boy who, like... Who doesn't go out at all and just, like, want to... Like, yeah, just, like, want to be around you 24-7. No. 
twenty. So I mean, which one? I feel like we can work on the whole like can't tell his homeboys no thing. Really? How can you? How can you work on that though? His ass is gonna be freaking tied to the bed or something. Like you ain't going. No, no. don't be. You no. gonna be locked in my in my house. No, I don't. No, I'm kidding. I feel like I feel like you're right. You can work on that, but once you that just starts another argument because then you just like, oh, my friends were here before you and blah blah blah. Like, but like no, because like then it's like if your friends are single too. If your friends are single, like if it's, if his friends are single mm -hmm. and he's the only in the relationship, like you don't know what he could be doing. Yeah, you're right. And like friends, guys, they don't. When they go they out, they be trying to, they be don't trying to put, that. they be trying you're to put you on another girl. Like, exactly. get, go get the joint over there. She fine. Like, exactly. she bad. Or they be, it's, it's not even like they be trying to put you on other girls, but it's just like, um, if you go out and you go out with single guy friends, they're more, they're more likely to like, you see them having fun. You want to have fun too. Like, yeah. you ain't gonna be thinking about your girl or nothing like that. So that's why it's important to surround yourself with like people, like people like you mm -hmm. or whatever. Not saying that, you know, opposites will clash. But I'm just saying, like, if you're married, there's no way to be going out with, like, people who are exactly. single and, like, you know, just... And I feel like at a certain age, like, it gets to the point where, like, going out should be, like, the least of your worries. A minimum, a bare minimum. If yeah. it's not, like, an event, like, a special event, like, a party or yeah. something. Like, if you go into, like, the club, the, the, club, the bar, like, and... <laughs> you 40 years old, bitch, stop it. Stop it. You need to be at home, wife and kids, please. Hey, this is probably going to be the last one if I think of another one that we'll do it. Would you rather have your man have a female best friend? Best friend that she my sis, she my sis. Or would you rather have a, um, him have a homeboy that he be like telling y'all business to and stuff. Like pillow talking and stuff. Like what y'all do in the bedroom and all that stuff. Who is he telling that to? His homeboy. Oh, he's telling his homeboy what we do. Yeah, or would you rather him have like a female, a female best, best friend? But his homeboy run his mouth as well. Like to other people. Yeah, so he'd be pulling talking to his homeboy, but his homeboy be going back and saying, "Oh yeah, she she don't do this, she don't do that." Like, I <laughs> mean, do. is the girl best friend? Like, are they really genuinely friends? That's the thing. Yeah, because so you got to question with, that too. Exactly, if they're doing like. Like, he was like, oh, I'm finna go to my... So, so yeah. what if he come up and you be like, oh, I'm about to go to Stacy house? No. We're both going. <laughs> we're both going. You ain't gonna trust him? Or she can come here. You ain't gonna trust him to go over there and do what he say you gonna do? It's, I, I will have to meet. I don't know. No. You're not going <laughs> to another girl's house. I don't care if that's your best friend, whatever. If well, that's your sister, your real blood sister, okay, that's a different story. But if that's shit, some girl you just call him sis. No. Yeah, but but he knew her like for years, even before he met you. I, I don't care, especially if he's. Good. So you gonna make him choose between like, him if and my sis? My man is like really good looking. Mm -hmm. I just feel like that kind of like, like she's not she's attracted to him. I mean, what if that's not her type, though? Just because your man, just because you just, think your man attractive, don't, don't, because I, I don't like when no. girls be doing that either. They be thinking everybody want their man. That don't be the case. Like, you just really think he cool. Like, I just, I don't know. I want neither. You have to choose. There's no neither. Either you get this female best friend, the female best friend, or you get the nigga who be telling your business in the street. So choose wisely. <laughs> Go into freaking public. <laughs> like yeah, I, oh I was just talking to Daryl and him and they yeah they they ain't doing too good in the bedroom. Mm, I guess the I don't want people to know my business. So you gonna choose to feed my best friend and why? <laughs> Cause you don't want people knowing your business. That's it. I don't want people to know. Like why would I want everyone to know my business? I but mean, it could be lies. Like, yes, I'm saying. That's what like, I'm saying. So I guess it really doesn't matter. But it all what depends does. on if the people believe it. Well, people gonna believe drama. To be honest, yeah. a lot of people believe. I would honestly, I think I would actually do the whole homeboy thing. Cause really, yeah. Girl, I, I just know. I just choose the female best friend because we gonna have a little meeting before we um before y'all do anything. There'll be some boundaries. There's no need to be hot and nothing. You don't need to be texting him. Um. In inappropriate hours, two o'clock in the morning, you don't need to be asking him what he doing. He with me. That's what he doing. Yeah. Like, no. You gotta draw the line between some stuff like that and a best friend, cause you do different stuff when you're in a relationship. So, now what you was gonna say? 
the female best friend. So why did you decide I don't, to I don't change like your answer? I didn't change my answer. <laughs> First of all, I hate her. <laughs> um, I would just say the female best friend because, like, like you said, like we can have a sit down meeting of what's going on. Like this is just a friendship, nothing else. Like no creep going behind me, like behind my back or anything. And like you that. need to let me know when y'all meet up too. Don't just be yeah. like, don't just but say going, it like two days later. Like, oh yeah, I was with Stacy. House and stuff like that's no. That's kind of inappropriate. And then y'all having y'all little dates and stuff like. I just feel no, like even if you that's have that's not gonna be fine. With that, that's what I'm saying. Even if you have a female best friend, that should be like separate. Like you shouldn't be like, oh yeah, I'm gonna go out to eat. Take me out to eat. I'm hungry too. I'm coming too. What you mean? Yeah. Like I don't feel like it's like even if you do have and a female like, best friend, like why are you taking her out to eat? Why are you yeah, going to her yeah. house? Like you can chill with her. Spending more time. And, and it can, it can you can chill with her over here. Her and stuff yep. Like that. Like, and that's yeah. how that's how people get together. That's how the attraction start. I'm telling you. But that ends this video, guys. <laughs> Say bye to my friend Nay. She will be bye. in some other videos as well. But make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel because we going up this year. And yeah, see you guys later. Bye.